In this picmonic, let's recall obsessive compulsive disorder, or OCD, by this scene of the TV with OCD tiles. Patients with OCD experience repetitive and intrusive thoughts, shown by the repetitive and intrusive thought bubble. These are known as obsessions, and these obsessions can usually only be suppressed by thoughts or actions called compulsions, shown by the suppressing thought bubble with the desired action. For example, if the patient is worried about having germs on their hands, he or she may wash their hands excessively to alleviate the anxiety stemming from their intrusive thoughts about germs. These obsessions and compulsions often interfere with daily functioning, shown by the broken daily functions, as the individual can spend large amounts of time carrying out their compulsions. Although compulsions may be obvious to others, Patients with OCD may or may not be aware that they are performing an action or activity repeatedly, shown by the anxious character, both aware and unaware that his actions are affecting his daily life. Interventions used in the treatment or management of OCD include Cognitive Behavioral Therapy, or CBT, which helps patients to restructure maladaptive thoughts. There are other behavioral interventions, such as limiting time for rituals, Systematic desensitization, which involves gradually exposing a patient to an anxiety-provoking stimulus while they are in a relaxed state, and flooding, whereby the patient is exposed to the anxiety-provoking stimulus for a prolonged period of time, to ultimately reduce pathologic feelings towards it. Medication therapy for OCD includes first-line treatment with selective serotonin reuptake inhibitors, or SSRIs, shown by the selective silver tonic reuptake tube with inhibiting chains. Other drugs include clomipramine, a tricyclic antidepressant, shown by the clam map ramen, and venlafaxine, the vanilla fax, which is a serotonin norepinephrine reuptake inhibitor that can also improve symptoms of OCD. So, Let's remember that patients with OCD experience high levels of anxiety via repetitive and intrusive thoughts that can only be suppressed by thoughts or actions called compulsions, which may interfere with daily functioning, despite a potential lack of awareness by the afflicted patient. OCD interventions include cognitive behavioral therapy as well as drug therapy comprised of SSRIs, clomipramine, or venlafaxine. For obsessive compulsive disorder, think of these OCD tiles. And this guy with OCD has an obsession with sorting the tiles by color. And this obsession gives him anxiety. So when he sees disorganized tiles, he feels a compulsion to sort them in order to find relief. His thoughts became intrusive, forcing their way into his mind, repeating over and over again. Sort the tiles, sort the tiles, sort the tiles. These thoughts can only be suppressed or hushed by thoughts or actions involving the sorting of these tiles. The man was so obsessed, it started interfering with his daily life. He stopped paying attention to his girlfriend. He stopped going to school. He stopped going out during the day entirely. Sometimes, he was perfectly aware of how this disorder was affecting his life, and he would cower beneath the window. Other times, he was blissfully unaware. For the rest of the story, check out Picmonic.com and sign up for a free account. There, you can also take Picmonic's quiz. The quiz automatically sets up your daily quiz by using spaced repetition algorithms based on the questions you've missed or struggled with to make sure you study what you need when you need to. And while you're there, check out the rest of our Anxiety Disorders Picmonics. We've got all the content you'll need to remember. Everything from anxiety assessment, Obsessive Compulsive Disorder, Post Traumatic Stress Disorder, Social Anxiety Disorder, Trichotillomania, and so much more. So you can lock down on everything you need to know forever. Play, quiz, and spaced repetition. Efficient, effective, and research proven to increase exam scores.